Yes. I want to know about Mama Said. That yeah. is a song with some lyrics, man. Yeah. Like, if you haven't paid attention to those lyrics, Canada, seriously. Mama <laughs> Said, like, who, that's a story. It happened, it happened to you. I wrote, I wrote it. I wrote it. Please tell that, tell that story to the camera. Like, let everyone know. Well, I grew up in a, what you might call them as a, a hippie commune, a marginalized neighborhood. Um, but I never realized before grow like I was an adult, that we grew up poor. Wearing second-hand clothes and a lot of leftover meals, meatloaf with not a lot of meat in it. If you get the drift, um, and, but I felt I grew up rich because we had like all the people in the whole neighborhood still know each other. Like yeah. several of my best friends <laughs> are from there. Like people say, "Oh, so you're good friends with Mark? You've known each other 11 years?" I'm like, "Yep, only 11 years. <laughs> I've got like friends of mine that I've known for 25 and 26 years. Guys I grew up with in the neighborhood. Uh, we've known each other since." We were tiny little kids, and right. we still hang out, and we still like with fifteen boys have known each other almost all our lives. Yeah, and yeah. So Mama said it's basically about growing up poor yeah. and wanting to make it big and not giving a shit about what people think or say about you. Uh, and of course, seven years. Congratulations on that. Thank you. Smash everywhere. Like there's no way to predict when a song is gonna hit. What is it about seven years that you think grabbed the world? I think you should ask the world that question. <laughs> well, I want to know what you think. Probably the age thing. Everybody yeah. gets older. Yeah. There's no hook in it. Everyone can understand the song. It's like an old style song. Everyone says, oh, you invented something new. Nah, we just went back to something old. Right. Rather than trying to make fast food and popcorn, we just decided to write a song that meant something from start to finish. And Mark was actually in the room when I wrote it. And I remember when we reached past 20, I was like, so where do we go? And Mark was standing there with a vodka Red Bull in his hand going, keep going! <laughs> Run, Forrest! <laughs> and so we kept going. And, uh, and nice. it became this epic journey through life. Um, before we get to the, to the performance, I have to ask, of all the songs that you guys have written, do you have that one song that maybe you're keeping in your back pocket that you know the world isn't ready for just yet, but you will release eventually? We have more than a thousand unreleased songs. Yeah. So uh, a lot of yeah. songs that the world uh, isn't ready for yet, but mainly because the productions aren't there, tiny tweaks on the hooks. Okay. Not all songs are written, like Seven Years was written in three hours. Bang. Right. Took two years to produce it, but it was written when it was written. Right. Th better Than Yourself, written and recorded 55 minutes. Song wow. about my friend who gets riddled with bullets and sent to jail after surgery. Um, so you can say that some of the songs need fine tuning, and you yeah. keep digging them up, looking at them, putting them away. So uh, yeah, it's a it's All a right. fluid process. Kiss. Yes.